Hello everyone, welcome to AB Animation Studios, After Effects Tutorial. Today, we are going to create this. are watching our tutorial for the first time. Please check all our uploads, and if you like it, please click that subscribe button and press the bell icon. I have already imported the images in the project tab. To create comp click this icon. We are going to use the same settings. Import your logo in the comp. Pre-comp the image by right-clicking on it. Follow the same settings. Duplicate and hide the below one. We'll use it after some time. Now apply fill on the duplicated logo pre-comp. Change the color as the same. Now for the light rim which you saw in the reference video. Search CC Light Sweep in the effects and presets, and apply on the logo layer, and animate it as your wish or follow the same as how I am doing. For this kind of light effect, we are using a Saba plugin, which is 100% free. Check the description to download. Before using that we should have the mask path of the logo layer. To create that we are using, auto trace option. Please follow the steps to create. Select this logo comp and enable this option. And then go to layer in the menu bar. Then select auto trace. Leave the settings as it is. If you are not able to see the mask path, just click this icon to see. Rename the layer to easily identify. Hide our main logo comp. And search Saber in effects and preset. Apply on the Saber layer by dragging and dropping. So to see the glow around our logo, just select the layer mask in, core type, which is in the customize core section. Now the glow is more, you can adjust it from here. There are lots of options to explore. For this tutorial we are going to use a preset called cellular. Before moving to animate this, we should start the stroke animation, which we saw in the reference video. To achieve that, create a solid layer. Decrease the opacity, so you can notice where you can focus. Now draw a ring like this, no need to be perfect. Bring the opacity value back. Apply Saber on it. To make transparent, change settings in render settings to transparent which is in composite settings.
start animating it. Please watch the video, this is the same animation similar to trim path, first end and then start. To make your animation more fluid, use a graph editor, apply easy ease by pressing F9, and make the curve the same as how I am doing. You can see the difference. Trim the layer. We will create the second ring, the red ring animation. Duplicate the blue layer and then change the color. To make it in the opposite direction, in rotation give minus 180. Now we'll start animating the logo stroke animation. To make the stroke path reveal in the same time and place, we should adjust the mask evolution. So while animating, it will look like it's coming from the ring stroke. For end stroke also do the same thing like how we did for ring animation. Just duplicate and then change the color. Now adjust the mask evolution. If you are not able to see the background, just check the composite settings. Looks perfect. Now it's time to animate the main logo reveal. We are using Gradient Wipe to reveal the logo. Search in Effects and Presets and apply on the layer. We need some texture to give a more rusty look. Do it in the same way as I do. To make it more interesting, please follow these steps.
to make animated images for the background. Just had wiggle expressions. Give smooth zoom in animation. Create a null layer and parent all layers in the null layer except BG and solid layer. Add fire particle stock footage to give more cinematic look. Hope this tutorial helped you. If you have any doubt please write your questions in the comment box. Also please check our uploads and if you like it please consider to subscribe our channel and click that bell icon. We'll see you in the next video.